Hi everyone, this is Hisham Shatter. Today um, I'll give you a quick overview of uh, Shatter Autorig uh, script. Uh, well, let's get started. Uh, first thing you need to um, change uh, your character name. This is not really important because you can change it anytime even after you complete uh, the rig. Uh, it's fully dynamic naming. Uh, after changing the name, you can uh, uh, s specify as a finger number. Uh, say it's four fingers. Create the guides. Adjust your guide to your um, uh, your mesh. Mirror. You can uh, fix one uh, one side and then mirror it. Uh, oh, you can save your uh, your guide if you have your with it. Just save. You can find it here. Um, delete it everything. Uh, second step, you can make your spine. This is the cool thing about this um, auto rig. It's not fixed to one uh, one kind of of, of rig. Um, if you um, if you're rigging for games or something, uh, you need to have a lower num number of, of bones. You need uh, you need you don't need uh, very complex rig. Just choose FK and rig it. This is the symbol FK rig just for controller for the, for the spine and the head and the neck FK IK spine um, if you do uh, really need to try it, uh, try download uh, Moody Character Rig. A Moody Character Rig is, uh, is on my blog. Um, it has everything of, of this. It has the same kind of, uh, of spine uh, here. You can change the spine uh, number of bones. These bones, you have FK right here. As long as the IK. You have stretching. You have stretching, coloring also. You have everything. Uh, if we change uh, the number, it's fully dynamic. Let's try IK only. Then make it sixteen points. This is the IK bones only rig. If we clean everything, you get the idea. Moving on to the limbs. Uh, just like the spine, you have uh, some uh, simple option to choose by. If you need the stretch, or if you don't need uh, the roll bones. Uh, if you're rigging for games, this is the kind of um, simple roll. Uh, this is the kind you, you would like to choose. 
um, let's try it see it in the okay this is uh, simple wall bones of course we have stretching like like the other model and everything you don't have uh, the bend in this in this mode but uh, you don't need it and let's try the other one can change the number of bones you, you need uh, something like 10 there it is uh, you can uh, control the bending uh, two two ways this con this controllers can change the curve also also you can change it from here just simple way to do the curving curving modes um you can do right arm legs are the same um you just need um, you just need to give it a number ten and create left leg create right leg the same you have uh, if we clean everything you have uh, uh, rolling have also also stretching So bending. Fingers are the same. Uh, let's say uh, we have fingers only creates um, you have two kinds uh, two kind of fingers uh, controller you can uh, you can create This one rotation uh, rotation helper. You have control over every uh, um, every digit uh, modifier. Will uh, will put the curling uh, modifier, uh, and you can control the curling from the modifier. And it's one controller only. Let's see it. Just a mirror. Let's see it. This is the first one. clean it to see this is the curling this is the thumb so it's curling weird because you need to adjust it a little
like this, then freeze it. It will carry light. Other type of finger uh, finger controller is uh, by modifier. It's just one controller. Let's try it. This this ugly controller. By the way, you can change uh, this uh, this controller by any shape you like. I will show you how. It freeze. Just fix the keyboards. This is the curling here. Very simple, really. And you can change it from here. After finishing everything, you go to finish and create master controller and link everything to the master controller, the IK and the hips and uh, everything. Uh, and link also the, the arms, the, the legs to, um, to the hips. Uh, then organize this will do as magic uh, this will uh, uh, organize everything um, on layers uh, delete the, um, uh, the guide we don't need it uh, give you the skin bones skin bones in here uh, if you give it give it to the mesh one click uh, uh, you don't need to choose the bone by bone uh, and your rig is ready let's see uh, finished rig this is moody rig character rig it's free it's on my blog you can download it and try it um, uh, let's see uh, if i don't like this kind of um, of shapes or controllers i just uh, make a new one this is a new controller controller shape bickets choose it replace hang on pick it choose this one replace just like this um, another thing um, this is the main controller <coughs> here you can see save your animation load your animation uh, save your bows if you like this 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 is saving tempo boss. Uh, here you can key everything, you can uh, reset everything, you can delete um, every key. I'll delete keys and reset everything. You can load the boss by clicking uh, just like this. There is a boss manager. If you like, just save boss. It will take a second. This is the boost saved. Uh, just don't change um, any names of the layers. Just don't change anything. If you like uh, to change the naming, um, it's uh, in the options. Um, this is not the final one. If I need to change this uh, this character name, just give it a name and change it. We need to, to re reopen the options. It's now named Shutter. 
you can hide and show your uh, bendy curvy uh, controller from here uh, you can change the stretch squash uh, this is uh, loading bipedal animation um, setup um, it will um, auto rig itself it will save you a lot of money it save you a lot of time uh, give it a try and if you like it uh, get a license um, I hope you enjoy it uh, see you later guys